Wow, I'm right on resonance. That's an accident. We didn't try that. That's a beautiful resonance. Who on earth could have predicted these nodal lines? I will go to higher frequency. I will lower the volume a little. Wow! Look at that. You see where the anti-nodes are, it's thrown off and it accumulates at the nodes. Hey, that's a weird one coming up. My goodness. I've done this many times. Every time I do this, I see different ones. Because you can so easily... No, the, freak, the normal mode frequencies are often so close together that you can very easily skip one and go over one. Isn't that amazing? How... Oh, you look at these lines here. It's completely ridiculous. <laughs> Oh, this was a different one, right? Different from the previous one. I'll increase the volume. When you're coming up to a resonant, you can even hear it because the sound, in, the sound volume increases. Holy smoke! Isn't that amazing? You try to calculate that. I would like to think, though, that Aero and Astro people who design airplanes, we have wings, and people who build bridges, that they should be able to calculate these resonance frequencies. Because you may get destruction. Look at that one. I've never seen this one, Michaels. <laughs> this is completely bizarre. All right, so you get the idea. And I really would uh, like you to play with that, uh, with the ones there at the end of the lecture. See whether you can excite them.